Hi, I'm Dr. Chalmers. Let's talk about pneumonia. Every year in America, over a million people are sent to the hospital from pneumonia. 50,000 people in America die every year from pneumonia, and pneumonia is the number one killer of children five and under in the whole world. So what do I use to help protect my patients and my family from pneumonia and those symptoms? <clears throat> This is a pulse oximeter or a pulse ox. You can easily find them on Amazon for about 12 to $15. What it does is it measures the amount of oxygen that is in your blood. You put it on like this, give it a second, and it'll give you a readout. The normal person will run between 97 and 100, both adults and children. And that's basically what we're looking for in a healthy person. Now, as we get pneumonia and our lungs quit producing oxygen to carry through our bodies properly, what ends up happening is that the amount of oxygen in our blood starts to decrease. So what we need to look for is a pulse ox of about 94, 95. When those numbers start getting down to those, that level, that's when we start going to the ER, that's when we start calling our doctor and saying, hey, little Jimmy, little Susie has a pulse ox of 94, and normally it's 98, They've got a cough, I'm a little bit worried about it. You know, let's go check that out. Early prevention can help a lot of this stuff. So the case that we basically see often is when a child or a person has a cough that gets worse at night because they're laying down. As they lay down, the pressure in the lungs, the fluid sits a little bit differently and it makes you cough and it makes you more uncomfortable. That's how we know that we have fluid in the lungs. When we see the pulse ox numbers drop, that's when we know it's causing a problem all over our body. Get in, get checked. Early prevention is the best way to keep yourself from having a serious issue. Thanks.